Look at my burly. Mm hmm. He's super sexy. Mm hmm. Yeah. There's my jam for this game. Okay. Alright. It's crappy, of course. I mean, who else would it be? I mean, you're on my channel. You should know who I am. I shouldn't have to tell you. But here with what's supposed to be, hopefully, a better commentary. I think it will be. I've learned from my mistakes. And yeah. I mean, alright. Quickly, I'm gonna just get into what this is. I'm using a loadout recommended by Rento and M. Rent. Rentonum. No. He's a dude on the forums. He was saying he's been using it. And I actually did exceptionally well with it, and I like it a lot. I mean, still would prefer insoles to the jetpack, but, um. Really good. I think I go 36 and 2 in this gameplay with it. I mean, I did kind of camp this health station a bit, but um, yeah. Really good loadout, by the way, whoever you are. I really like it. And I'm using snowflakes on both of them because I want camos. I mean, that's what that's what the subject of this is gonna be. I really am looking forward to Scarjonic. I don't know if you know, he did say that we can expect Kitty Camo very, very, I think he used three berries actually, so very, very, very soon. And, um, he, I did ask him if he meant last Friday soon, and he said not that soon, so hopefully I can be expecting Kitty Camo. I'm also hoping for Rainbow Camo. You know, 5,000 kills, or depending on whatever the weapon equivalent is, it's five times how much it is for Pro 8. And, I'm really hoping that the petition that I have going on the forums, I don't know if you haven't already signed it, should go sign it! I <laughs> really want Rainbow Camo changed, I mean stickers for 5,000 kills, it just doesn't seem good. Oh, 10 kill streak. But, I don't know, I want something magnificent. Magnif- Magnificent. <laughs> no, no, no words. Magnificent. I don't think that 5,000 kills with the weapon you should get stickers, honestly. I love Monolith. I think they're a great company. I think that it was lazy on their behalf. I think they totally could have put more into the- This is just terrible. Don't even know what I was doing here. Oh, sorry. I think that they could have put more effort into the camo itself. I mean, all they did was take the rainbow symbol from Mighty Hunter 5, if you guys don't already know that. And that's what they did. They just plastered it all over the gun. I mean... They did the same thing with dinosaur camo, and I don't have a problem with it being for dinosaur camo, because that's that's a f paid camo, I mean, it's something you can you go on all guns when you buy the steamy punk pack, so I'm totally okay with that, and I think it's cool for what it is. But for the kills, it should either be a completely rainbow gun, which would be the most amazing thing in video games ever, although I highly doubt that'll ever happen, or they could just reskin the gun, so instead of it being the background of the normal gun, it would be blue, a baby blue, kind of like the snowflake, maybe a little bit more bluish, <laughs> and then put the rainbow stickers all over it. I would be totally okay with that and rock it, but I was, think I was talking to Max the Gun, I was saying that if you have the rainbow camo and somebody kills you with it, unless you're really looking for it, you're not even going to notice that they have it. Because it's as if they were using no camo. I mean, I rarely even noticed that people have dinosaur camo on and dinosaur camo, but well. Anyway, so rainbow camo. Hope that gets changed. Kitty camo, that'll be awesome. Um, what else was there? I'm about to hit a thousand. I believe I'm currently at 992 at the time of recording this, though. By the time it's uploaded, I'll probably be higher, and hopefully we'll hit a thousand tonight. If not, I'm gonna hit it tomorrow for sure. Now, a lot of people have been suggesting different, obviously, gonna upload a gameplay of me hitting a thousand, no matter how bad it is. Some people were saying Bombardier, some people were saying Thunder Dragon, some people, I don't even know. I'm just probably gonna do a Bombardier, Thunder Dragon, both golden, loadout, um, so that's that. This is actually the first in this series I'm gonna be doing of you choose the loadouts. They'll be much less common because... Well, the forums aren't exactly active, especially the loadout, loadout, whatever discussion is not common. So I'll probably do maybe once a week, once every other week. The one I will be doing, it was recommended again, MacLegon. Um, he recommended that I use, um, because I do have gold for every gun, minus the Marshall, which I will do when I hit a thousand. Um, 
So he did recommend that I did a gold gun series, especially with the harder weapons to get gold. Tips, strategies, loadouts, and um, obviously show off what the golden camel looks like. And I think that's a great idea. I think it's kind of fun. So yeah, I think I'll definitely do that. I mean, sounds like fun. I'm, I'm really liking this commentary. I feel much more confident in, than the other one, and I'm going to change the volume so you can't actually hear me. I think it's an improvement, hopefully. I think you'll all think the same. And I'm hoping for the best with this channel. I mean, I think um, I did do a dual commentary with Mac yesterday, which I don't think is going to be on his channel until the weekend, but I'll be looking out for that. Mac the Gun, I'll, I'll link him in the description. <laughs> Even though you probably, most likely, 90%. Probably 100% know who he is. I mean, if you don't know who he is and you're on my channel, then what's wrong with you? You're bloody mad. You should be on his channel. He's a great commentator. Really cool that guy um, to talk to. And um, yeah, we recorded for like an hour or so, and he's just going to edit it and put it in a commentary, which will be awesome. I also have some tips with certain gadgets, like the spring boots. I'm not going to give it away right now. Yeah, this... Okay, hold on. Go back to the gameplay. Um, there is a mighty on this trampoline, bouncing up and down, invisible. And he thinks that no one's going to see him. And I actually think that this guy goes off the trampoline and, like... I knife killed him. <laughs> Suck it, bro. Yeah, you're jelly. Um, I don't even know what he was doing. Is he, like, a low level? Is he as... That's just... Ugh. Let's see. Huh. But I love the Shredder. The only problem is, is I do like to play Nimble. That is my favorite body type. I enjoy Nimble. I like, a I like her speed. I like the way her costume pieces look. I love how fast and how high she can jump with the Nimble. I mean, with the insoles, Nimble. <laughs> um, I should have died here. Except he's, like, <laughs> low level and just, I guess, not accurate with the Shredder or whatever. I really enjoy it. I did never actually. I got Snowflakes the day the Snowflake came, came out for this. And I never even put it on the gun. I really enjoy it. I think I have like maybe four snowflakes. I have it for the shredder, the gatekeeper, the deep freezer, and I actually think that might be it. Um, I'm thinking quick. I don't. Up, oh, the gameplay is about to end. So there you have it. 37 and two. Um, nice talking to you. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and um, I hope you have a crappy day. This is my team. That's me.